Picking the perfect place for your wedding day is one of the biggest decisions you'll make leading up to the big day. Sherwood Gardens, the sponsor of this segment, is situated on an historic estate in Plainwell. And today we have Kathleen Russell in studio with us to talk about it. This is so exciting to have you here, Kathleen. Well, thank you very much. It's, 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 uh, it's been a, it's a real pleasure to be here and, and to... Uh, to talk about Sherwood Gardens. It's a hidden gem, and that's why this is so <laughs> exciting. When people see the images we're about to share, they will just be stunned, and many maybe not even know that you were there. So how did Sherwood Gardens get started? Well, it, it did start as a dream. Um, the, the, the estate was purchased in, in 2007 with the late Patricia Bromfield. Um, our vision was to create a serene environment for all people to enjoy. Uh, so over the years, um, the, the, the home, the grounds, and the event barn have been uh, completely renovated and, um, and ready to use. Yeah, so what makes Sherwood Gardens unique? I'm sure there are lots of different things. <laughs> well, I think it's really unique in, in, in that you stay there for the whole weekend. You have the, um, the home, um, the, the event barn, and the grounds, and you just, you just come in and with your family and friends and stay there and enjoy the, enjoy the property. Another thing that's unique about Sherwood Gardens is we, the 10-acre estate is located in the city of Plainwell. Even though it's, you have this rural feel, you are right in the middle of uh, many amenities. Anything that you need is right, right in the area. Yeah, there's lots there. There is a lot to offer. Can you talk a little bit about that? Yes. Yeah, so you, you get uh, the, um, you rent the, the uh, historic home. It has um, five bedrooms, three baths, uh, two sun porches. Um, you can sleep up to 16 guests. Um, you have plenty of space to prepare. Um, you have the event barn that can seat up to 150 guests. You have uh, lovely ceremony sites if you like grassy areas, garden areas, mature trees, woods. Um, it's, it's, all, it's all there for you. This is incredible. You know, people go miles and miles. They go to other states. They leave the country to find something like this. You're situated in Plainwell, just 30 miles south of downtown Grand Rapids. It's all right here. Yes. And it's tucked away, great photos, and it really does seem like it's all right here. Uh -huh. Plus, you can do events on your wedding weekend, too. Yes, yes. So what you do um, when you come in, uh, you come in early on Friday, you can uh, start setting the, uh, the event barn up, you can do your um, uh, rehearsal and then your rehearsal dinner. Um, then you spend the night, you get up the next day, and the bridal, uh, or the wedding party gets ready. Usually the, yeah. the brides take over the house. Um, <laughs> they need space. Um, and uh, you have your ceremony, um, then your reception, spend the night again, and then Sunday um, is, is clean up. Yeah, so, and uh, it's great. You might have a, a brunch or a gathering in the morning, too. <laughs> yes. It's all right there. It just sounds so easy. Yes. There are amenities with your event barn. Can you talk a little bit about that? Yes, um, the, the uh, event barn has been renovated. It, again, it's a historic uh, barn. Um, it can seat 150 guests on the main floor. Um, there, it's complete with uh, tables and chairs. Uh, we also have ceremony, white ceremony chairs. Um, we have custom uh, head tables for the wedding party. Um, we have a custom bar. Mm -hmm. um, you can set up uh, the area any way you'd like. There's also a loft area, and um, upstairs you can, there is a built-in uh, custom stage again, and uh, people use it for um, you know uh, games. You can set a, a DJ up there, uh, photo booths, and most recently we had just a lovely ceremony there this weekend with about 75 people up there, and um, it was it was very cozy, very. Uh, very warm and charming up there. Yeah, so. I'm seeing these images and it includes so much. I know that sometimes when people have events like this, they have to go and order the lights. They have to set up someone to put up the lights and a lot of the extras. Um, but a lot of that is built right into the whole cost of using the property. Yeah, and you can set it up if you like the more elegant look mm -hmm. or more rustic, um, but you don't need a lot. I think it's more just doing the table settings and then setting it up the way that that, that you feel. But yeah, it, it's all there. And easy is good on a wedding weekend. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> And still look beautiful. You have a separate carriage house and honeymoon suite. 
too. Can you elaborate on what that is? Yeah, so that is actually across the street from Sherwood Gardens. Um, this is an 1800s building um, that was completely renovated as well. It's This is more of an elegant uh, style. Um, it's uh, There's an upstairs loft bedroom, downstairs a kitchenette, um, a sunken bathtub for two. Um, it overlooks the river with, um, there's two decks, um, and it's it's in a naturalized setting with uh, big, you know, uh, the mature trees, naturalized gardens, and so forth. And it's just that special place for the wedding, or for the um, bride and groom to have on, that, uh, on their night. And you always need extra space just during right. the weekend. You just need extra space. So. I bet you get that request too a lot saying, okay, so we're in the beautiful big house, but on that night, we kind of want to just yeah. be a little bit yeah. alone. Have a little privacy. Well, I tell them you're gonna get sick of all of these people. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So they and they're right across the street anyway. I know that you take pride in making the guests feel very comfortable, and that's really important to you. Yes. Um, you know, frequent communication. Um, I promptly respond to people. You don't have to call and call to get a hold of me. Uh, people are welcome to come back, visualize the place. Um, and we just take uh, a lot of uh, 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 time in, to detail the estate, uh, the, the home. We, we want it to be perfect on your wedding day, mm -hmm. and we want that wow factor. When you, come, when you get there on Friday, we want you to say, wow, this place looks great. Right. And then on Sunday, we want to hear that everything was perfect. Many times guests say, um, Oh, our, our guests just love this place, and they will yes. come up to me, the parents, and and so that's that's why we do it. Um, we just we just love that uh, giving back, and yeah. Uh, yeah, it is. It's a magical spot. Well, it really looks and sounds like a dream <laughs> wedding destination. And here you go. This is the address. And you can also go online and learn a little bit more. Do you suggest that people, if they're interested or have questions, contact you through your website? Yes, you can contact me. Uh, yeah, through the website is, is, is the best uh, way to do that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's been lovely showing everybody Sherwood Gardens and what you have done there because I know it has been a labor of love and something you enjoy very much. Yes. Could I just, uh, I would just like to uh, end with, um, I just want to thank all the, the many people this it took a village as they say my family and friends many wonderful handy men handy women um, who have uh, made the magic come out in, in Sherwood Gardens yeah so thank you it's very evident you can see that too <laughs> and I'm sure it's even more special when you get there oh thank you so much thank you Kathleen we appreciate it thank you and this segment is sponsored by Sherwood Gardens we'll be right back with more 8 West don't go away That's West.